Okay. This is an ultrasound study of uh, 16 years old girl with the history of uh, lower abdominal pain for the last one month. Now this is the uterus in romitorinal section. The uterus of Mayer's 7.4 by 3.2 cm. This is the endometrial canal. This is 10, uh, approximately 11.8. This is the urinary bladder in the urinary section. This is the cervix. No fluid is seen and there is no focal lane. The endometrial canal is clear central. Now, this is the right ovary. This is the right ovary. Let me clear it for you with the developing follicle seen. Dominant follicle is seen in this ovary. Now this is the this is the uterus, this is the ovary, and uh, the ovary measures 2.9, 2.3, sorry, by 1.95 millimeters. This is the developing follicle, this is the right ovary, this is the developing follicle, uh, the dominant follicle. So the pelvis is okay. Now when I move to the region of the right iliac fossa, I see a cystic uh, area, thick wall, cystic tubular area. Here it is. This is the urinary bladder. You see, this is the urinary bladder. And here, when I move the probe towards the right iliac fossa, this is the urinary bladder again. This is the urinary bladder in longitudinal section and as, as I move the probe towards the uh, right side, this is a tubular structure, thick wall, internally clear of any calcification, debris uh, and or any solid element. So this is the Tassidium Bidatilaitardia. This is a cystic area, thick wall, and this is the appendix. This is the appendix, thick wall, with internal clear lumen. This is the lumen, and these are, this is the wall. Wall over appears hypoipoid, but because it, it gives a long-standing history, so 6.7 millimeters is the thickness of the wall and in longitudinal section you can see a few centers within it. So because of being partially treated by the antibiotics, it is showing some uh, internally clear of any debris. Small amount of fluid is seen. This is the fluid. This is the case study of uh, appendix. This is small amount of fluid behind this uh, cystic area. Thick wall cystic area with thick septas. This is a thick septa and there are a few thin septas as well. This being the urinary bladder, and uh, this being the uterus, the urinary bladder, and the cystic area, which is the appendix. Thank you. Now, remember that uh, this is something that uh, uh, we also call or remember as mucosine of the appendix. And the mucosal of the appendix will give you this appearance. 
as it's internally clear of any debris, uh, that means no internal echoes are seen in this cystic area, which is a pendicular invocation. This is the appendix, as it does not relate to the ovaries or any other part, pelvic organ. It is uh, not relating to any other organ. So, uh, this is a mucus, most probably, this is a mucus seal of the appendix. <coughs> because, sorry, because no calcification, no solid element is seen uh, within this uh, cystic tubular area. So, uh, the possibility of mucus seal of the gallbladder cannot be ruled out. Thank you very much.